Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Crash Bandicoot 4. It's about time. Last time we, uh, what did we do last time? We finished off, uh, this area. That's right. Uh, well, almost. I got all the gems for this one and, uh, this one in my own. I was thinking in my own time when I'm not recording, I should just go get the gems and I'll show you guys how to get colored gems when they show up because there are colored gems in this game. But, uh, there is a flashback tape in uh, this level. And something I actually learned is uh, you don't actually need to uh, complete the level without dying to get the flashback tape. You just need to reach the flashback tape without dying. So that's something very interesting I just learned uh, before recording. But I'm going to show you what flashback tape uh, it is now. So here we go. Wumpa Affinity Test. Alright, I'm really excited for this. I love playing this game. Alright. Okay, maybe I can do, uh... I should just head over here first. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Embryo, the mop! I love that line. <laughs> Alright, I'm on this box. This box. Boing. Oh no. Get out. Mm. Uh, I made it, yeah. Two, three, four. <laughs> uh, that's good. I love this game. It's so good. And the writing is so good as well. The characters really feel like they were how they were set out to be in the uh, trilogy and other games that uh, came out around it. I feel like Twin Sanity is very underrated, but it, it did a lot of good for the Crash series, I feel like. Of course, I can understand why people were against it. The whole... The fact that it was uh, completely different from what Crash was. Crash was definitely a very linear, level-based game, and Twin Sanity was uh, very definitely a... Uh, got it. Don't do that. Oh, well... Make sure you, yeah. Da, da, da. Uh, uh, no. Mm. Ooh, that was close. I almost died there. I have a good feeling about being able to get all the boxes in this one run. I feel like it's a possibility that I can uh, that I, I, that I can achieve. I love that they just remix the music from the first game. It really fits in with these flashback tapes. Up, oh, mm, nice. I'm so good at this game. Yeah, that was a life box I lost, but whatever. Yeah, I did it. Woohoo! First try. I, I did die, but I didn't have to re I didn't have to restart. That's all that matters. 
All right, let's go. We now enter the land of the Weeaboo. And we're gonna give Coco a go at this level. Give it a spin. Oh, there's a flashback tape in this level. Cutscene? I'm imagining so, because, uh... We met a mask last episode. Yep. <laughs> I was wondering where Crash was. Oh, no. Ow. Punching holes in reality, we could open our own rifts. Uh, oh god, embryos right there. But I sense another rift around here somewhere. <laughs> Friends, I have a fun little game for you to play. I've got a reward for the clever bandicoots who can reach my testing grounds. But you'll have to release my suggested diabolical creations along the way. Weren't we friends? Did, didn't we help you once? Thought you were against Cortex. Oh, well, whatever. Let's not question it. It's a video game. Ooh, there's a new mask, Kano. We never actually learned what your mask power was in all the, uh, in all the gameplay trailers. It never actually talked, Toys for Bob never actually talked about you, so I'm, I'm excited to see what power you actually have. You're the only mask whose power I don't know. Oh, Dark Spin. That's interesting. So it's like an infinite spin. I like it. I slid really far that time. I like. Can it break open? Oh, we can break open the iron crates. It keeps you in the air longer. Yeah. Huh. Okay. Oh, and you still have control of your double jump while you're doing that, by the way. Okay, so we need to use it here as well. Like I just said, you can still double jump while you're doing the uh, Dark Matter spin. Oh, it does detonate TNTs. Okay. Aha. The hidden gem, yes. Aha. I, just, I had a hunch it was around there somewhere. Huh. Oh, that was just a jump we could make. Okay, there's a flashback tape actually. Perfect. Great, now I've got it until the end of the level. I just had to die not... I just, had, I just couldn't die up until the flashback tape. Because the flashback tape I... Oh, shit. What? Wait, we could we could break engines and uh, megaphones. So can we? Yeah, but it doesn't give us a trophy. That's just sad. Oh no, it did. Okay, great. Okay, never mind. I was incorrect. It just took a while for the trophy to show up. Oh, I bet we're gonna have some fun with some fans on some dark matter spins later in this world. I can just tell. Oh, nope, not the nitros. Oh, that was so embryo. Dark Matter Spin deflects green magic. Yeah, I can hit it in the face, can't I? Okay, huh. I guess it doesn't do anything. Hmm. Ah! Oh, wait, was I defend- No, I was not defenseless. I lost my- I had an Aqua Aqua Mask. That's how I survived that. So yeah, be careful that it does hurt you, as you'd expect from the warning earlier. I just didn't notice it until it was too late. Okay. I still have my flashback tape, right? I didn't just imagine that, right? I guess I can't tell what I have on me. But anyway. Oh. Oh. Mm. We. Mm -hmm. oh. We. Okay. Uh. Beep, 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 beep. I really love this Dark Matter spin. I feel like it's going to come uh, into play later. With, it's going to give us a lot of interesting puzzles later. Ah, 
how do I make you visible? There's gotta be a box somewhere I can hit to make you visible. I, I don't imagine we'll be able to come back here later. Oh no, I missed that one TNT box though. Aww. Can I just die? I just throw myself off a cliff or something. Yeah, this seems... Yep, there we go. It's okay, Coco. It's all for a box. It's all for a box. Just keep that in mind. Smash. It doesn't help me because I'm at a... I'm going to have to restart the level, aren't I? Yeah, because I hit a, I hit a checkpoint box. Wait, no, I did not. Yeah, I did hit a checkpoint box. Mm. <sighs> restart. Alright, and I'm back. That's where I was. I got that uh, TNT crate I missed. And we're ready to go. Huh. Ugh. Can we make it back is the question because there's a there's a bunch of crate there's a there's a bunch of crates back there that we couldn't break. Maybe it's the colored gem thing. Uh, 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 there we go. Oh, well, I have the flashback tape. That's all that matters. I I did recollect the flashback tape. Don't worry. So you're not missing anything that you okay. I, can't die for the rest of the level. Well, no, I can die one more time. Uh, yeah, I need to remember to not do start my double jump until I start death tornado spinning. Well, dark matter tornado spin. No, okay, don't double jump that quickly either. Up, up. Up. Mm. No. Okay, I'll go back and get that gem later. Uh, uh, how did I get it right the first time and now every time after I'm screwing up? I guess that's just... Nope, I did it again. I don't know. Is it the Let's Play curse coming out of me? It's probably what it is. Uh, uh, uh. Mm. I'm going to have to assume that both TNT crates were broken. Not that it really matters, because I probably can't get the box gem anyway. Oh, I don't have um, a Kano anymore. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, just normal jumping from now on. Shut up, embryo. <laughs> nope, nothing around there. Uh, uh, uh. Alright, let's go. That's how you're meant to do it. Because you can't break the, uh... can't break the bottom set of crates without, uh, breaking these ones. I need to blow these up. Boom. Ow. All right, woo. Uh, uh. Uh, okay. Okay, well, that was a failure. Let's try that again. Okay, now then, let's see. Uh.
Boom. Uh, ground pound. Uh, mm, I'm going to leave one box over there so I can actually get back. Boom. You set that off. Ugh. Nice. Uh, mm. I'm so good at this. My only problem is there's one box I'm not gonna be able to get now, so I'm probably gonna have to blow it, blow it. Yeah, I can't get that box. Dang it. Okay, at least now I know what I need to do. I just need to not break that. Sorry, I need to actually just make sure I break that box. Okay, so I actually found the exclamation box that lights up all those, um, that lights up all the, uh, what's it, those, uh, outline boxes. It's really hard to notice if you're not actually looking for it. So it's behind here, and you can only get it after you've, uh, gotten the mask for the death spin. But that's, yeah, that's how you actually, uh, uh no, 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 mm, okay. Whew. Yeah, no, that's how you get those, uh, outline boxes that are just up ahead, which I'll show you in a second. After these blow up. Boom. Boom. Start spinning. There you go. Now we actually have a hope of making it to the end with all the boxes. Up. Up. Turns out I had a, a completely wrong read on how to do this bonus up. I meant to slide here. I messed up the slide jump. What we're meant to do is we're meant to slide, jump up here, go around here, and do this part first. So, uh, mm, ba, 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 boom. Sweet. Hup. Ooh. There we go, and that's how you get that box that I missed. Uh. We bunch of wumpa fruit. Mm. And there we go, that's all 31 bonus level boxes. Now I just need to survive this part. Nope. No, my fruit and boxes. All right, that's that bonus level out of the way. No, eighty. Why, please? I just want my, I want my third wampa fruit already. Also, I had to re. I think I had to restart a few times. Ah, okay. And well, there goes all those restarts because now I can't even get the tree, uh, tree, uh, the tree death one. The tree death gem. I was gonna say tree death wumper fruit, but no, the tree death gem is what I meant to say. How am I doing on boxes? I feel like I'm doing pretty well. I think I might get all the boxes. Hopefully, if I'm aha, uh -huh. take that. Okay, take that. Phoenix right moment. Uh, <clears throat> keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay, I should stop here. I'm gonna do some bounces here. Okay, ooh, ooh. Uh, uh, mm. What the, what the, huh? 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 Excuse me? Excuse me? What the hell happened? What the hell happened there? Oh, I need, no, no, I need this box. Uh, uh. Excuse me one second, Embryo. I know you're trying to kill me, and I really appreciate that that's your goal here. But, like, please, can you just kindly, you know, screw off so, so I can actually do this properly? Oh, no. Uh, mm, okay. Okay. Whew. Mm. 
Okay, so we need to we need to do a death, uh, dark matter spin from there to there. Understood. I comprehend this plan. Oh wait, oh, it does nothing. It just takes you back. Okay. Well, hey, now we know. There we go. Okay. Whew. One, two, three, four, five. Up. Okay. Uh, uh. Okay. Burr, 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 boom. If I could get like all the boxes in this run, I'd be so happy with myself. Okay, we need to blow up this TNT because I said sometimes I sometimes forget to blow up the TNT. That it just. It's just how it goes sometimes. Nice. Okay. Uh. Up. Mm. Oh, yeah. No, I missed the. Oh, wait. No. Oh, yeah. The nitros. Yes! <laughs> I did it. I got all the boxes. I feel so accomplished in myself. Okay, let's check out the flashback tape for that level. Bandicoot versus Wombat and Veil. Oh, are we, uh, are we doing a boss fight in a flashback tape? That would be interesting if we were. No, I think it's, I think it's just a funny naming. <laughs> I got the idea from cartoons. Uh. Okay, huh? I like the name they put into this in uh, this level because um, it implies it's got something to do with a boss, and they're actually playing um, Koala Kong's uh, boss battle theme from the first game. We don't ever see much of Koala Kong after the first game, now that I actually think about it. I, I, the only game I think he ever shows up in... Yeah, he only shows up in Crash Bash afterwards. And, well, Crash Team Racing as well, but he didn't show up in the original. He only showed up in the... Um, he only showed up in the remake. After, after um, Phoenix added him in one of the Grand Prix's. I should have died from that, but I will not accept the judgment of the, I will, uh, not disagree with the judgment the game gave. Two, three, uh, 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 nice. Ooh. Uh. Uh. Wee. Nope. Mm. Damn it. Oh god, okay. This flashback tape has uh, definitely been the scariest to do. No question about that. No question at all. Oh, ha <laughs> ha! Boom. And up. No! Mm. God, uh, uh, mm, uh, mm, mm. I did it! Yay! Uh. Yeah, no, this is just to get to here, I'm assuming. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm not looking forward to this. Oh well I just seal I seal myself in now. I could try something but it's not gonna end well. Yeah, no, it didn't end well. Ugh. 
Okay, here's what I think you have to do. You have to avoid that. Okay, uh, okay, let's go. Go! Mm, made it. Ah, oh, damn it. There is no way. Okay, uh. Okay, uh. Mm, mm. I gotta hit this one first, it seems. Uh. These are all just normal boxes. Hup. Hup. I really love the remix of this music they used here. It's really good. Two, three, four, five. Hup. One, two, three, four, five. Hup. Yay, bounty box. I like the bounty boxes. They make me feel safe. Uh, yeah, I got all the boxes. Yes. Mm. Mm, nailed it. It seems like we have a ton of level now, so I'm going to assume that maybe she was the one who actually uh, blew up that gate. So we're going to play the ton of level next. And I'm going to say it's Coco, so because when we... Because every level we've had so far with Coco, we've switched back. When we played as Tana, we switched back. And uh, we played as Crash, but I played as Crash in that level. So I'm going to play as... Uh, I'm going to keep us on Coco so that uh, when we switch back, it stays on her. Because we just played as her in that level. Pretty self-explanatory, if you ask me. But yeah, what's, go what's going on here, game? Why can we play as Tana in this level as well? Game, can you can you load, please? Okay, here we go. Reminds me of Neo Nippon, minus the kaiju kanuki. Uh, I will get that life box. Nope, okay. Mm, ow, that was a bad idea. Okay, I can't even reach it. Alright, so I, ha I have to grappling hook it. There's an invisible wall uh, keeping you from jumping on it. Oh, never mind. You can grapple hook it. It was just really finicky. That that's the one complaint I have with Tana's gameplay. Ow! Anyway, as I was saying, uh, yeah, that's the this is the one complaint I have with Tana's gameplay is that her grappling hook feels really, really picky from time to time. It's just like, no, you can't do this, even though you really should be able to do it. But that's the one complaint I have with uh, I. That's the one complaint I have with Tana's level. <laughs> oh, kawaii this one. I'm sorry. That that must have been so offensive. I'm so sorry. <laughs> But, um... The, uh... What was I gonna say? Right, yeah. The grappling hook just feels a bit finicky from time to time. The wall jumping, it's fine. You just need to get the hang of it. Uh, yeah. It's a bit hard to get when you start playing as Hana, but after your first level playing as her, you'll, you'll understand how the wall jumping works. Hmm. Not sure how you meant to get that box. But yeah, no, the wall jumping, you start you start to you you figure it out. It seems like these uh lily pads don't set off until you step on them. So maybe do we have to hit hit the box from a, a bit away?
Oh, okay, I can't reach it. Mm, dang it. This one's going to take a bit to actually get. Okay, so you can make it to this island from uh, this second lily pad. Okay, phew. Okay, this lily pad's a safe one. Up. Mm, mm. Okay, huh. Okay, well, oh, there we go. They give you a thing to clip onto. I didn't even notice that. We one, two, three, four, five. Uh, 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 mm. Up. Uh. Mm -hmm. uh. Oh, oh, there we go. Uh, uh, no, I didn't even notice it. Ow. That's a rip. That's a big rip. Oh, well, at least they didn't set me back too far. Wow. Just wow. Huh. No, Tana. Ah! I do not like these lily pads. These lily pads are annoying. Okay. Huh. Mm -mm. Nope. Mine. Mine. Stay out of my way. Break you. Huh. Get that life box. Huh. Not a life box now because I've already broken it off camera, but whatever. Okay, we have to go this way. Uh, uh, mm. Phew, okay. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Oh, it was Embryo, but... I get it. It was Embryo, but he missed because Tana yelled at him. Okay, I like that. Okay, that should not have happened. <laughs> we, uh... Boom. I like this. It's not the exact same level you're going back through. There's there's subtle changes to it to make it either more difficult or more bearable. I don't know. There's, there's just something different about these levels when you when you replay the, the... Shut up. I already listened to you. Huh. No. Okay. Okay, then I guess. Up. Up. All right, then. I don't enjoy this as much as I thought I would. Uh, this is getting frustrating. It's getting annoying to kind of do. This is definitely the worst part of this level. I like the level concept in and of itself. It definitely teaches you the mechanic of how Akana works. But, oh boy. If you take your eyes off Coco for a split second, uh, she goes flying. And I'm assuming, and I'm, it's not even just Coco. I'm pretty sure it's the same, same goes for Crash. If you take your eyes off them for a split second, like that. <laughs> See, and now you're sent all the way back here. That's definitely the hardest part. That lily pad, that was just a bad... That was just me badly playing this game on my part. But it's, And the stuff like that. It's the small platforms and it's the... It's the small platforms and it's the... Uh, and you're still kind of learning how the dark matter spin works as well. But I think the best way to do it is just do a single jump, use a Kano, and then use your... Second jump to actually make it across gaps. Up. Uh. 
The reason why I failed earlier was because uh, I didn't spin, so the box kept me from advancing. I, think, I keep feeling, feeling like there's a box over there that I need to break, but I know there isn't. Okay, hop, let's go. Alright, let's redo the bonus level again. Oh my god, okay, so it's a different bonus level. So yeah, we need, okay, we need to blow those up. Yeah, okay, I can. Uh, so I'm assuming we're gonna have to break these next. Whoop, whoop. Bonk, bonk. Uh. Whee! Uh. Bonk. Up. Hmm. Oh, I see what I was meant to do. Yeah, okay. I see what I was meant to do. I see what a mistake I made. Okay, huh, huh. so we're over here now. And now, we can go break those three boxes at the start. Which one of them is a TNT now? Huh. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah, she did it. I thought I was going to kill myself somehow. Huh. Ooh, ooh, that was close. I'm pretty... Yeah, I can make it from here if I slide jump. Uh, uh, huh. Nice. We and on the bonus platform. And off we go back to the main level. This will get me up to that damn right. Thank you. Even if I can't guess, uh, I'm definitely not going to get the death three times uh, gem. But if I can at least get uh, the other gems, like the Wumpa Fruit and the All Boxes gem, I would definitely take that. Did I? Oh, I think I saw the hidden gem. No, it's just a glow from that lantern. Okay, continue. I just saw a silvery kind of light and... I remember playing the demo. I played uh, one of the levels and I found the hidden gem. Just I could see the reflection of the, not the reflection of the gem, but like the glow from the gem. And that's how I found it. So I thought maybe this level was going to be the same kind of idea. But it seems not. Up. Up. Okay, up. Uh, up. Uh, uh. Wee, okay. Up. Wee, hop, hop. Yeah, I have to believe that uh, the nitros are the remaining boxes we need, as well as these ones here that we're gonna break along the way. Oh, there's like tree along our path now. Ugh. I'm so glad these are normal lily pads, not the snappy lily pads. Okay, I do need to go back and get this box. Hup. Uh, nice. Mm. Okay, we can jump from this lily pad as many times as we want. Uh, uh. I, I think we have it. No! Mm, Alright, well, I'll come back to this level in the future. Oh, that was annoying, though. Uh, Alright, well, I got three out of six. That's pretty good. Okay, let's play this next level as Crash. And, uh, do I have a Jap- Do I have a Weeboo Crash? I don't think so, which is unfortunate. But anyway, we're gonna go play this next level, dragging on as Crash. Alright, let's go. And there's a flashback tape in this level as well. All right, noted. All right. Uh, huh. I really like this world. I really like it. I like the aesthetic of it. I at least know that much. I like the aesthetic. I don't know if I... Uh, I don't know if I like the music. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's funny. I really like that one. 
<laughs> That's something I always love about these games. The humor definitely shows. Crash games are, are just... They've been funny since the start. Uh... <laughs> Yes, Embryo, are you planning on working out? Are you planning to train that glute of yours? Okay, yeah, I should have known by my shadow, actually. That, yeah, okay, no, we need to jump from that platform over to the uh, boxes. Okay, keep going. Oh, God. Uh, okay, I'm just going to walk past you. Can I maybe... No, a Kano goes away. Okay, hup. Hup. No, okay. Hmm, how to get that box is the question. Uh, oh, okay. That's that's how I just did. I just did my, I did my second jump too early. Uh, mm. uh, oh, I thought there were boxes up there for some reason. I just didn't. I didn't give it a good enough look. There aren't boxes. Over. No, they're not boxes. I don't think. Ow. Ow. All right, then. Fine. I see how it is. Okay, yeah. I like this dimensions of aesthetic, but I don't like the music. It's a bit too... It's a bit too boring, to be fully honest. I know this is a tranquil world, and, that's, and the music is trying to reflect that, but the music just kind of just... It just feels a bit boring. When compared to Crash games of the past. I agree, it's for the theme of the world. And it, it's liter it literally has... Dimension literally has Tranquil in the name. But I, it, I just feel like it's just a bit boring. But whatever. It, it's music. Music's subje subjective. I'm sure there's a ton of people in favor of uh, the Tranquil music soundtrack. Okay, oh. Also, that's just this world. I don't think that about the... That's just this uh, dimension. I don't think the same about the other, di other dimension. Wait a second. We have a Kano. We can just go past those music th thing. They're not music things. They're gongs. This is because I was on about music. I was right at the checkpoint as well. Ugh, that's annoying. Up. Uh, hmm. Up. Uh, hmm. Okay, land. No, okay. Oh. Okay, well, I'm actually right at the checkpoint. So, let's just try again. Hup. Uh, and I made it really easily that time. I made it across of almost no problem. I almost killed myself, but that's that's besides the point. Uh, just, just go right past me, thank you. Oh, there's a flashback tape. Yeah, I'll have to come back and get that next episode. Because uh, I think shoving it into this episode might, might be just a bit too long. Oh, you can hit those gongs with a, a Kano. Mm-hmm. Mm. Uh, okay, nice. Yeah, oh, mm. I'm just gonna wait for it to go off. Uh, uh, mm. uh, ooh. We okay. Uh. Uh, there's something in there. I feel like that is either a. Alright, what I was going to say is, um. 
No, okay, what I meant to say was... What, no, not what I meant. What I was going to say was... Um, oh, come on. Snap into it. Yes. I think that uh, thing I was asked was either a... A path to a colored gem... Or a path you can only take when you get a colored gem. Uh, mm, 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 no! Mm, damn it. Okay, We, okay. Checkpoint. Okay, bonus. Actually, no. We'll go. Yeah, take the bonus path first. Ooh, it's a it's, ooh, it's an Econo bonus path. Okay, I don't think he protects us from nitros. I think he just uh, I don't think he protects us from the nitros. I think that was my Aku Aku mask that saved me. Uh, they never yeah. If they, actually, if he protects us from the nitros, I feel like there would have been a pop up tutorial that would have. Uh, Explain that. Damn it. Alright. Up. Up. No. Uh. Okay. Up. Yes, I did it. Okay. Uh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Up. Uh, okay. Phew. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. Ooh. Okay. Question is, where's that one box I missed? I missed one box. Okay, I'm gonna come back to that because it's just taking too long and I I don't have all day to just replay the bonus level over and over and over. As much as I would love to, I don't have all day to replay the bonus level over and over and over again. Up, 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 up. Ugh. My shop crash. No. Ow. Okay. I see what I need to do for that. Huh. Okay. Huh. Mm -mm. Okay, we need to land. Uh. Ooh, there's a box up there. Uh. Yeah, the one downside to Akano, and this is definitely planned. I feel like it, this was definitely intended, and I'm not, and I agree that it should be intended. For the amazing spin powers you get, you lose a bit of control. You do lose quite a bit of control from Crash. And I feel like that was intentional, and I'm actually happy with that change because it, it balances out. It balances out the uh, insane spin powers you're going to get for just a little less control over Crash, which is definitely intentional, and I like it. Uh, mm. Mm. Uh, mm, mm. Ooh, okay. Yeah, it's okay. Don't worry. I'm just happy this level's over. It, this was this level was actually kind of a pain, to be fully honest. All right, let's continue on. All right, let's play off balance as Coco, and then we'll go do the boss of this world as a Crash. All right, let's get started with this level. That could be a lot of things. 
That doesn't really help now, right down. Oh, well, at least he gave us a hint. It's something. Okay, the first time we've ever seen... Ah, oh, sweet. Okay, so the first time we've ever seen... Okay, never mind. That just answers my question. I was like, I don't know if I can spin those enemies. Because the first time we had encountered those enemies was a Tana. So I was, I was kind of... I kind of had the mindset of just like... Mm -hmm. I feel like Embryo is still very, very bitter about uh, the events of Crash 1. Because you can see right here, he wants to uh, betray Cortex. I, f I feel like he's siding with Cortex to uh, upstage this from him. And, um, to, yeah, I feel like he's doing this to uh, take the spotlight from uh, Cortex and become the main villain. He just needs to... It's just, he knows how powerful Cortex is, and he needs to defeat Crash to see if, if his weapon is strong enough. And I like that. I like that. It gives him a reason to follow Cortex. It gives him, because he knows Crash will come to stop Cortex. And that's why he's joining him. And this is where I feel like uh, he and Engine differ a lot, and they really can't be considered replacements for each other. Engine is definitely, uh, com he's completely loyal to Cortex. He would never betray him, and we've never seen signs of him wanting to betray Cortex. Maybe in Titans, I th or Mind Over, no, it was Mind Over Mutant when that. Oh, no, no, I'm th no, I am thinking Titans. Am I thinking Titans? I don't know anymore. <laughs> but I know there was one game we saw a little bit of a... Uh, engine being disloyal but apart from that he's mainly loyal to cortex the whole series and the second embryo gets um the second embryo gets betrayed he uh all well is betrayed the right word i, can, I feel like it kind of is because uh Cortex, yeah, Cortex replaced him with Engine. And then, where I feel like, um... One second, everyone. I'm just gonna try and, uh, fix something. Alright, let's continue on. Hoop, get up here. Okay, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, no. Okay. Hop. One, two, three, four... Five, six, seven. Okay, hook. Okay, hook. Jump, jump. Uh, uh. Uh, up. Oh, well, there's that flashback tape, but uh, I've already died three times, so. Speaking of which, I should try not to die for the rest of the level. How many boxes do we have? Okay, we're a little under halfway. Boom. Nope. Alright, hup. Okay, no, uh, give me a second, Akano. I want to go do the bonus level first. Well, already right, right away, I can see uh, what I have to do. Hup. Hup. Yeah, I can already see what I need to do. Okay. My question, the one thing that was bothering me about that uh, bonus level was, am I going to, uh... okay, the one thing that was bothering me about that is that, will this TNT trigger all the other TNTs or do I have to activate those separately? That answers that question. I should, 
I sure did not expect to be able to finish it this time. So. Nope. Ow. Yeah, the first time I actually got a good look at the crash icon that actually comes out of the life boxes. It's interesting in a way. Okay, hop. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, here we go. I was just hanging out up here. <laughs> Whether that was the intended method or not, I have no idea. Okay. Ow. Hmm. Alright, I need to think about how to get over those. Okay, I'm gonna do the same with this bonus level. I'm gonna leave it. And it's not that I believe I can do it. I believe you can make that jump at the end over those nitros. But I tried at least a good 10 times and I was not able to make that jump over those nitros. So I'm going to I'm gonna leave it there. But um, that's a really good bonus level. I really actually li I like the layout of that bonus level. It's just it feels a bit too difficult for me to actually justify. For me to justify my continued attempts with it. Right, huh. Okay, huh. Okay, we. Okay. Oh yeah, do do it from here. Nope, that was not a good. That was not a good jump. Hey, okay, huh. Oh, hello. I went a different way. I don't know what's going on over here, so let's just try it. We Oh. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely meant to be uh I'm definitely meant to be non spinning coco. Oh, oh. Okay, well let's try this part again then. We hop up we Out. Okay, I feel like the. Okay, I I don't feel like I know the fruit is trying to lay out the path if the game wants us to take with this. Up, uh, we need to break here, and then when we reach over here, uh, but we can now go back this way, jump over those nitros, and then make it to that platform. I did not. Oh, there's a turn box here. And now we can make it to that platform I did not know how to get to before. Huh. Hey, I did it. Oh, God. Hup, hup. Uh. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh. Aw. It feels like you can go either way, though. You can go up or you can go straight down and then across. Not straight down, but like, after you go across a bit enough, you can just go down and then continue on the level that way. Okay, I saw a checkpoint box when I went up, so I'm going to go across this way and see if there's anything else that seems a bit strange. Up, up, up down, okay, normal Coco. So I can do this, break, up. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh. Or do maybe, or maybe, do I have to, um. Do I maybe instead have to. Up. Oh. Up. Up. Uh, no, ow. This is difficult. This is really difficult. Oh my god, I just noticed. Uh, Akana does the ooga booga when uh, he gets collected. That's sweet. I really like that. Uh. Hey, thank you. We oop nope fall we oh, nice. Uh, bye. Those tigers are funny. Wait, did I just call them tigers or lions? What the hell? What the hell's wrong with me today? No. Nope. Mm. Uh, 
Uh. No, ow, aw. Okay, finally made it past that lion that killed me every goddamn time. Okay, let's go. Mm. I believe that we can make it. Okay, that that just takes you to the hidden gem. Okay, well, uh, since I am, I doubt I'm gonna be getting most of the gems. Let's continue along our predestined path. And when I come, okay, at least I showed you guys where to go and how to get it. Okay, at least I showed you guys that much. Now we're gonna continue along the predestined path we were meant to take by the level. Okay, phew. All right, I'm gonna wait for these lanterns to go out and run. Uh, mm. Okay, run, 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 run. Ah, I did not think I was. Okay, just keep running, just keep running, just keep running. I almost died. <laughs> Up uh, we uh uh ooh. Uh uh mm, 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 nice. Ow. Well that just that just blows. That just blows. Okay, so now we have uh now we have Lonnie Loli back. Which is nice. I like that we're using multiple masks in a level. Because here's the thing. What they could have done is they could have, uh... Phew. I was worried I was going to die and I had no idea what to do there for a second. What they could have done is they could have, uh, just had one, only one mask used per level and they, and the game would have been just as amazing. And they didn't. They, they... Uh. I'm sorry, I can't. Up, uh, one, two, three. Okay, so what I was going to say was they could have had the levels just be no, you're only going to use one quantum mask per level, but they didn't. They allowed you to use, use multiple masks. Well, they said it, so multiple masks could be used in levels, and I like that. It just adds more to these levels. Oh god, I forgot. I was I forgot I phased in and out of the platform. My bad. Oh, well, I'm all the way back here. Okay, hop. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, God. Oh. For a minute, I thought running along the wall was only a, was a quantum mask thing. I forgot Coco could... No. As long as those things that are Coco and Crash can just do, them whenever, do that whenever they want. Okay. Huh. Mm. Uh. Whoa. Oh, I did not realize that that was a breaking thing. No. Oh, there's the end right there. I can see it. Oh, okay. All right. Whoo. Look at her break dance. But yeah, no, I did not get a lot of gems in that. I'll do them off camera, though. I showed you. You know how to get them. It's not really that difficult. I just skipped a ton of boxes by accident, but... Whew. Okay, let's do the embryo boss and we'll get this episode over and done with. Not that I don't want to stop playing. I, I want to keep playing, but oh my god. Ooh, okay, let's play Crash. Let's go. Alright, trouble brewing. Let's do this. Well, that was a fail. That was a bit of a failure in my eyes. <laughs> oh, did I just do the same thing? I didn't crash one. No. If you're if you're wondering, the reason why I'm actually playing Crash in this boss is uh, because uh, because we played as we had to play as uh, Crash the last time we fought Embryo. And there's a reason behind why I played Coco as well in the engine boss. What the hell is this? Oh, God. Uh, uh. Oh, no, I was right there. I was right there. Uh. Okay, huh.
What if I can spin those green things? I doubt it. I, I assume, I'm just gonna... Okay, I'm not gonna test it. I'm just gonna jump on them just in case you can't spin them. So I don't think you can spin them in Crash 1. I believe this boss is just a giant Crash 1 reference. Now what the hell is this when this happens? Whoa, 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 Phase two? Yep, phase two. Here we go. Alright, let's do this again. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, I did not. You could walk off the stage. Whoops, my bad. Oh, I, okay. I like that you start from phase two. Oh. Mm. Oh. Hmm. Got to quantum spin him out of the ring. Mm. All right, I see how this boss works. All right, come on, embryo, try, just try me. Mm. Out you go. Mm. Oof. Bye. I still have no idea what this thing does. I can tell it's meant to do something, but I have no idea what it does. I actually have no idea what this, like, weird dimension-y thing does. Everything, oh, I, I like the wireframe look of everything, though, in this weird part. Ugh. Oh, that's it. Sweet. Ha! Ha! Take that. And now for my final test. Taste my reptilian wrath. Make me wake up. No. Ha. Yeah. That's definitely interesting. And that egg, that egg's definitely going to come into play at some point. But I think, unless there's another cutscene. Bye. More gems to collect? Oh! Okay, it's the inverted mode. Okay, so that's how we have inverted modes. Okay, so now every level has an inverted mode. Oh, classic crash skin unlocked. The engine inverted. Uh, oh, but we have we have discover all the effects of embryos potions. Okay, I see. So now we just need to go to unlock classic Coco Gobi engine with an, an inverted mode. Okay. Well, um, I think I'll show off some of those on camera. But um, but yeah, uh, I I don't know when I'm gonna show off those inverted modes. Probably after. Let's go. Let's do that after the game. After the game, we'll go back and do all the inverted modes. But um. Next episode, we'll show off uh, this new dimension, Mosquito Marsh. But uh, yeah, I'll see you all next time. I'm so excited.